And AJ, <laughs> uh, that's what he does all of. <laughs> just gonna walk up here. This is AJ Sullivan. And Austin. Woo. I've lived in 12 states in Spain, and I've settled in Austin. That says a lot. I'm a children's author, A.J. Sullivan, although most of you know me as Amy Mayers. I, I worked in the school district, Amy Mayers. I've published six children's books so far. Most were written in the mid to late 80s as stories for my two sons. Thank you. The Bobby Bear series follows Bobby through several of life's milestones. In the first book, Grandpa teaches Bobby how to fish. Then, Bobby is the only one to oh, Bobby is the only one to catch a fish big enough to eat when they go on one of those, you know, five o'clock in the morning fishing trips that Minnesotans love. Minnesotans. <laughs> Sorry, getting used to it. <laughs> um, and yep, the second book. <laughs> Not rehearse this. <laughs> uh, find spot. Oh, I have a drill sergeant. Why you want me to use that instead? You want me to? You can. I was in the Navy. I can speak loud enough to speak to 80 people at once, but I'll still use the microphone. <laughs> I, and I can't tell you what I did in the Navy. I'd have to kill you. Um, <laughs> just saying. Um, sorry, I digress. Uh, second book finds out he's becoming a big brother. The third book, he graduates from kindergarten and worries horribly about how different first grade is. The fourth and final in the Bobby Bear series has him dealing with bullying, which is a very current issue, which is why this book was written. Uh, and he's in second grade in this. The next book. Finkel and Franny is a beginning chapter book based on the true story of when two flies joined us in our car for a cross-country journey. <laughs> Seriously, my kids wanted to smack them. I didn't want blood in the car. Uh, my boys and I created a story about why and how the flies got in our car and why they chose Buffalo, New York as their exit location. <laughs> I'm from Buffalo! Oh. Um, who knew I-90 could be such an adventure? <laughs> Parth and Gnome is, um, is a picture book about Brandy the Lab and Bertha the Gnome who saved Christmas. My next book finds a pair saving summer. It will be out soon. All of my books are available at Sweet Reads, of course. Thank you, Lisa. While you are here milling about, um, come talk to any of the local authors. We'd be happy to answer any of your questions. Thank you so much for being here to support your local artists and enjoy Austin Artworks. Thank you.